Okay guys, so check out Flex Your Freedoms. I'll put the link to his channel in the description. Uh, he does very good work on dealing with law enforcement and consider liking, subscribing, and sharing. So here's the thing guys, law enforcement, they don't respect the constitution, right? They don't respect the constitution to film in public, right? He is filming in the police vehicles, which is, is not, there's no law against it. He's on a public property. He's not in the vehicles. He's not going in the vehicles. They tried to arrest him because he's filming the police department. It, there's nothing illegal about it. Like there's, there's nothing illegal about filming in a public area. So all there is no links to inscription. All filming the police. No hey, Don't film inside the vehicle. Grandma's filming. Don't do it. Why not, darling? Because there's there's per personal property in there. And there's sensitive items in there. But grandma's in public. But don't film inside of the vehicles, okay? But grandma's in public. You can't film other people inside of other people's cars, okay? Oh, I can't film inside other people. It's personal property. My eyes can see it, a camera can see it. If there was any private sensitive things, I see you got your your spit bottle, you know. So 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 what, darling? So I told you you're fine to look at the vehicles, but don't don't be filming inside the vehicles, okay? It's the same thing as looking at them. It's in public. I'm telling you not to do it though, okay? Is that an order? Yes. So you'll arrest me if I do? Are you mean to elderly folks? One, sir, you're not elderly, okay? That's discrimination. Well, then fine. I'm a call grandma. It, call it what you want. I'm a grandmother, and I don't approve of this, sir. Okay, well, your behavior right now filming inside of a police vehicle is suspicious, so I'm going to ask for your ID now. Oh, did I commit a crime? You're being suspicious, so I'm now... What crime is that? I'm is that now, a misdemeanor I'm or a felony? I'm investigating. For what crime? Suspicious and it's not a crime. No. Because I haven't determined yet if you've committed a crime. Well, you, you have you, to before you come and ask for ID. Oh, I do? Yeah, what's the Fourth Amendment, silly? I do not need... Know the Fourth Amendment? I do not need permission. Yes, you do. You we have a constitution. Yourself. I don't need permission from any of... From you, especially, to conduct my job. What I'm crime asking, did I commit? I'm asking, you have not committed a crime yet, but there right we now, go. I'm, There's the answer. I am suspect. So, no, I, I'm suspect of you. Terrible Ohio is a federal ruling. Iowa law is not the only law of the land. I have probable cause. You have to have reasonable, articulable suspicion before you can have probable given cause. Given your demeanor and given you... Oh, so it's illegal to be a grandma now? Listen, let me see your ID. How about hell no? Not, if you do not identify yourself, I will place you under arrest. All right, then arrest me, because that's okay. a Fourth Amendment violation. Okay. Put this down. Oh, I'll just hold on to it. If you... Why are you being difficult? Why are you trying to violate my Fourth Amendment you're, rights? You're, you're, you're intentionally goading and antagonizing. And antagonizing what? Standing on public property? You just said I could this look inside. This actually is not public property. Yes, it is. Where's the signs restricting? And you this just gave me permission property. to come. Private property is not a police station. Who pays for it? We the people. You, you had an oath to, up, swore to uphold the Constitution, yet you're trying to violate a grandma's rights no, I'm not. for filming. Because no, she I'm doesn't not. want to give you ID because you said she committed no crime. You have to have reasonable, articulable suspicion that a crime was committed, is about to be committed, or already has been committed. What, what crime did I commit? And you said no. Yeah, where, where, where is that from then? What, what do you what, think? What, what Iowa code? What do you think? What Iowa code? That's your job. So here's the thing. It's not an Iowa code. It's a federal Supreme Court ruling, okay? And federal laws take supreme over state law if it conflicts with it. So he's quoting federal law to the officer, and his officer doesn't know the law. What Iowa code? What's the Fourth Amendment? What Iowa code? What's the Fourth I'm not Amendment? Sit here and you argue swore with an you. oath to the Constitution. That's your number one job. I am not. And you're over here trying to violate rights. my rights, no, standing in public videotaping. No, I'm not. There's zero. Pr pr what's private information besides your spit you, cup? You're intentionally videotaping, doing this. being nice, and, and being cordial. Your little, your little viewers here are probably getting a real kick out of this, aren't they? I don't know. You ask them. You could look in the camera and say hello. 
Hi. You know how many people are watching you right now trying to violate a grandma's rights? What right have I violated? You? My Fourth Amendment. What do you think the Fourth Amendment is? Have I violated To be secure in my, in my persons and papers. I'm not going to sit here and argue with you. Okay? Well, then violate my rights. That's up to you, but you're getting a lawsuit if you try. Listen. No, com no crime was committed, and you need that to get ID. That's end of story. If you don't like no, grandma don't. filming, yes, you do. No, you I do You need reasonable, not. articulable suspicion of a crime. So what crime is that? You said there is none. You know what an investigation is? Yes, that's what you conduct if you determine if there was a crime. And you determine there was no crime, so you just failed. Grandma's smarter than you. Okay. Always film the police. Get back to the video and enjoy. Grandma. It's true, and you know it. You can go ahead and violate Grandma's rights all you want. It's going to be bad on you. If you need your supervisor, need to call the sheriff because you don't know you're the job that you've signed up for, upholding the Constitution, you don't know the Fourth Amendment. Did I, a cop? I never said I didn't. How do you know I wasn't a cop before? Were you? I don't know. Was I? I'm not, that's what I'm asking. You. I don't have to answer. I, you don't. You're a public servant. You don't. You're supposed to serve the public, and I'm a and I'm the public. Am I not? Until I commit a crime. And you just said there's no crime committed, but yet you want to violate my rights. Have I, My I, first and fourth I, amendment. I, I you just said, said that you were going to place me under arrest if I don't give you ID. That's my fourth amendment right. Grandma doesn't back down from shit. I don't care if you back down or not. Well, then you're going to have fun in court. Imagine all the jury seeing this, trying to violate an elderly you're, you're woman's rights. Too. Yeah, they'll see that and they'll be like, wow, this grandma's been very polite and cordial with you. And you came up, said there's no crime being committed, yet you demand ID. Do your investigation then. For what crime? Reasonable, articulable suspicion. That's what you need. Grandma's a war veteran. You understand that? Grandma actually fought for these rights. The ones that you're trying to strip from grandma for doing nothing wrong. War veteran. Okay. Yes. What war? This is actually funny. I'm having a great time watching this video. Get back to the video. Okay. Trying to take our freedoms away. Mm. Hell no. Hell no, darling. This man's a bully. This is Grandma. Fox. He's videotaping inside law enforcement vehicles and Which is per perfectly acceptable. To identify himself. I don't have to. He said no crime's been committed. There's absolutely no crime that can be committed. Okay, is there anything I can help you with? <laughs> Tell Stanley to stop being a naughty boy and to leave oh, Grandma alone. No, Stan, it's, it's, Stanley tried arresting Grandma. Behaviors, you want me to hold my horses? No, no so just hold on. I gotta talk. You gotta let me speak. Is that okay? If you listen to Grandma afterwards, Grandma will let you. Fine. All right. So you can I talk. just got on duty. I have no idea what's going on. I just came in here. Yeah, it's, no, it's, that's it's very, all right, Fox. It is very unfamiliar to have somebody videotaping the inside of cars. It's kind of weird. That's why he's. Well, they're there. police vehicles They're bought by the public, are they not? They are, but it is weird for people to videotape the building, wouldn't you? I don't think so at all, darling. Yes, I be, think people should videotape buildings they buy. Yeah, but this car. isn't your house. This is public. This isn't private property. Mm -hmm. There's a huge difference in between that. You don't see me going up to some private people's property. This is we the people's property. Okay. So, so Grandma's just out here. Uh, tell Stanley to stop trying to violate my Fourth Amendment. Bad Stanley, you're naughty. Well, the Fourth Amendment's a... Uh to be secure in my persons and papers, and he tried violating my rights. Ask for his identification. Yes, I'm pressed. Well, it's, it's, not, it's not wrong to ask for something. No, he name. demanded it, or I'm going to be arrested, was his exact words. And Grandma doesn't back down. Oh, I'm a Grandma, boob inspector. boob inspector, and my name's Grandma. Okay. Grandma's been around the block a time or two, Stanley. Just because you don't like what I'm doing doesn't mean it's wrong, so, Stanley. Uh, is, there, is there anything like that you came here to do? Or yeah, to just to film in public. You know where I just came from? Courthouse? No, Marshalltown, and you know how great interactions I had there? Fantastic. Good. They loved me. You know what they I mean, said? Good to enforce your rights and exactly because this well, nerd tried just, stripping them from me. What I'm trying to say is, let's not name call. Let's not do that. We're civil human beings. Are you right? going to name call me anymore, Stanley? I never name called you. You called me ridiculous looking. No, I said. It, it is is, yeah, I exactly. I, I look ridiculous, like you, you son yeah, of a I gun. Like I didn't you say before. you are. <laughs> yeah, you said I look ridiculous, and I said you look like a nerd. You said you are a stupid nerd. Well, you are a stupid nerd. There you go. Yeah, stupid nerd, Stanley. <laughs> so I just want to ask again, is there anything that we can help you with at all? Uh, tell Stanley to leave Grandma alone, and I'm out of here. Yeah, I'll, I'll tell me, tell me to leave. 
So yeah, I tell him. Know. I sure freaking do. Yeah, walk of shame, Stanley. Get out of here, Stanley. Right, well, I just, I just You're a son of a gun, Stanley. You can't violate my rights. I'm grandma. I do what I need to do. You son of a gun. So check out Flex Your Freedoms. I'll put the link to his channel in the description. He does very good work on dealing with law enforcement. He did a good job in this video. In my opinion, I think he did a good job. He's funny. He got some new persona. He's doing his thing, having a great time. And that's all that's important, really. So always film the police. Always film the police. All original links in the description. I'm out, guys. Peace. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye now.